Yo, 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 you already know what it is, man. This is your man, LaVon, and you already know what day it is. Let me hear you. Let me hear you say it one time. It's hot day. Yeah, you know what it is, man. It's halfway through the week. All the rest of the week is all downhill. You know what I'm saying? So we about to get into this wisdom on Wednesday real quick. You dig? Please make sure you hit that bell notification so you always notified whenever I upload content. Hit that like button and share this with your family, your friends, your coworkers, everyone you know. You dig? Let's get into it. Anyway, man, just coming back at y'all one more again this morning, man. You dig? With your wisdom on Wednesday. You feel me? Please like, share this video, hit that subscribe button so you're always notified upon my next video upload and so what i want to talk about today on this wisdom on wednesday is this timing man is key timing is definitely key in anything that we do in life you dig timing you know it's not that what we have to say is wrong or even the way we say it is wrong but it's timing timing is everything and if your timing is off what you have to say or how you say it will totally be um, not received, skipped over, missed, ignored because of timing. We got to make sure that we are operating in God's time and doing things in a timely fashion. You dig? This is your man, LaVon. This is your wisdom on Wednesday. Just want to give y'all a little nugget as you go throughout the day, right? Um with whoever you're dealing with, whatever you're doing, whatever your job task is, if you're working, if you're at home chilling, regardless of what you do, take today, today, and try to um, recognize. Now, be honest with yourself. How many times have timing come back and bit you in the butt? You know what I'm saying? Because your timing was off. Either you didn't pray about something, you didn't wait on something, um, you moved out of out of emotions or you moved out of bad or misinformation. And each and every time when you've done so, you realize that your timing was off. Sometimes you have the right information and you have, you know, um, the right words and you have the right motive. But yet and still, you have to make sure your time is on point. You dig? Listen, everything God does, it's all about timing. I mean, we talk about the blessings and we talk about, you know, the miracles and the mercy and the kindness and the favor and the glory. We talk about all that and it's well need to be talked about. But timing, I mean, we, we sing songs about it. You dig? You know what I'm saying? Uh, that He'll be right on time. He may not come when you want him, but he's always, always on time. You dig? Everything he does is on time. And 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 he's a God is a timely God. You know what I'm saying? Um, he already knows from the end to the beginning. Time. He doesn't, he's not constrained by time. So uh time works for him and for him because he created time. You dig? In other words, I'm just trying to get you to understand that, man. Sometimes we gotta watch what we say because it's not the right time to say it. Um, watch what we do because the timing in which we do things cannot just affect us, but drastically affect those around us, those that love us. You know what I'm saying? Timing is key. That's why we ought to be praying about everything before we say something or do something, because if our timing is off, it could mess up the whole get down. You dig? And that's just facts. Okay. I'll give you an example. It's like, <laughs> Where husbands and wives is concerned, right? A lot of times, and I found this to be true in my previous marriage, you know, I would be thinking something, you know, or the Lord would be moving upon me and unctioning me in, in, in a way or in an area, right? And then my wife would come and say something. You know, put a two cents on or say something about it. And it was always a time. And I would tell her all the time, if you would have just waited. I mean, I was already right there. I was right there. But you had to come and mess it up. Because your timing was off. Right. Or what about parents with children? Right. 
um, when, you know, when we have something we want to talk to our kids about, a lot of times we don't look at our kids as little separate emotional people, right? They have feelings, they have um, things that they go through, ups and downs, struggles, fears, things like that. They don't, may not even share with us. And then here we come right in on them, right? Our timing is not you know, it's not the the rest, the best timing for them to receive and hear what we got to say. You know what I'm saying? Um, same thing on a job or, you know, it could be someone on the phone. You calling someone on the phone about a bill. They didn't mess up something. They didn't overcharge your account. And, you know, you finna call and let these people have a piece of your mind when it could have really been just something simple or the way that you carry yourself and talk to them on the phone could have got your issue resolved a whole lot faster and a whole lot easier than your timing being off. You do what I'm saying? Can't have your timing off. Your timing's got to be on point. And those are just some examples. It could be a friend or a friend, a partner. You know what I'm saying? You think you overheard something, but you overheard it wrong. And then instead of you waiting and 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 to see the whole thing you address the situation. Your timing was totally off. You dig? It just, things like that is, is what I'm talking about. Your timing has got to be on point. How we treat people, how we talk to people, how we carry ourselves, what we say, uh, and how we say it. Timing is key. If your timing is on or off, you know, when you approach somebody to say something to them, right? Whether it's a harsh thing, whether it's a difficult thing, whether it's an uncomfortable thing, make sure your timing is on deck, it's on point. When you're going to give somebody some kind of instruction or, you know, um, if you need to correct somebody, um, if you need to, uh, um, you know, give them a, a encouraging and loving and positive word, you still need to make sure your timing is on deck. You feel me? Everybody is different. Everybody don't think like you do. They don't act like you do. They don't um, determine things, predetermine things, uh, you know, in their mind. So you have to be prayed up, hopefully, <laughs> and you have to be in tune to know timing. You dig? You man, Levon. And I'm out. One love. Remember, Lamella E. Love, uplift, motivate, inspire, learn, laugh, encourage, and enlighten. Lamella E.com. You dig? And now, LaVon, I'm out with you. Salvation, Home and Shelter Chronicles. Day five.